In this vid, I'll be showing one of the hardest sets to complete, the original base set in first edition. We'll start off with the hollows. So as you can see, each card has the first edition stamp and does not have the shadow that cards today have. Right here would be my first edition Charizard, but I have a PSA graded near mint mint Charizard. Um, I actually bought this from Troll and Toad thinking I was just getting an individual, you know, regular card, and it came PSA graded. So um, unfortunately, it does not fit in the slot, but uh, I'm going to make like a little pocket in this binder to store it in. Continuing on with the hollows. Now we're into the rares. And that's the last rare, Pidgeotto. And then into the uncommons. And I'll go a little bit faster. I think most people have seen what a base set card looks like. And by now you've probably gotten the idea of what a uh, first edition card looks like. There's really not that much of a difference. Um, they are, however, just extremely hard to find. And this was one set that I, uh, I was able to trade for some of the cards. Um, but the majority of the set, like the, the hollows, um, pretty much the hollows, I had to had to actually fork out the money and buy. However, I still saved quite a bit of money compared to what this uh, set would cost just to buy it complete. Um, I'm actually watching an auction on eBay at the moment that uh, has a first edition complete base set. And if anyone is interested, I can post the results of that just to give you an idea of what this is worth. Um, it's several hundred dollars, I know that. I don't think it's worth over a thousand. And that is the Red Cheeks Pikachu. Um, I believe I also have a first edition Shadowless Yellow Cheeks Pikachu, but that is uh, in another binder that's kind of a, uh, a promo error binder. Although technically I think the red cheeks is the error card. The original printing was a yellow cheeks. Um, now these are rare trainers. And now we're into common and uncommon trainers. Uh, uh, I should mention, these are a little harder to tell, um, the shadowless part. Uh, obviously, you still have the first edition stamp down here in the corner to go by. Um, there is just a uh, shadowless set that does not have the first edition stamp, and it's quite difficult to uh, determine which cards are from which set, just because you can... I mean, you can kind of see that there's no shadow along that edge, but it's very difficult. And now we'll go into the energy. Double colorless, and the stamps are now at the top. And your basic energy. Oops. So, that is my first edition base set complete. Um, I believe the majority of the stuff in here is near mint mint. Um, I'm going to be going through soon and putting everything that's near mint mint in ultra pro sleeves and then back into the binder pages just to keep them more um, more mint. And uh, I'll yeah I'll figure out then if I have anything that's damaged and needs to be replaced. But yeah, that is my first edition complete base set, including the first edition Charizard. Thanks for watching.